Welcome back to Brightside here on 10 Tampa Bay. We're your hurricane headquarters. It is August 6th, obviously in hurricane season, and you stand here looking at the map for the rest of the hurricane season. The activity typically really begins to increase as we head through the second half of August into really September and then October is when things start to wind down. But the peak of hurricane season technically on September 10th. So the activity really begins to increase this time of the year. The Atlantic relatively calm. We have a couple of systems that we're watching. The second disturbance will start with that, but this Invest 92L, Afro, a tropical wave that just came off the coast of Africa, that has a little better chance of developing. This first one, just a 20% chance of development as it approaches the Lesser Antilles in the coming days. Invest 92L right now moving to the west at 16 miles per hour, has 30 mile per hour winds. There's a possibility that it develops. It's a relatively disorganized area of showers and storms. However, in probably the next four to five days, it looks like it starts to move into more favorable conditions for development. Right now, the National Hurricane Center putting a 70% chance of development with this system, either becoming a depression or a storm in the next five days. At this point, though, no concern for the United States.